Welcome back. It's Eclectic Tarot here, and we're going to take a look at some energy, some tarot advice, some guidance, some messages for Gemini for November of 2022. The Magician in Reverse, Three of Pentacles in Reverse, King of Swords in Reverse. All right, what I'm getting from this is that unfortunately there was someone that has been detrimental to you. They are someone that you know, is or has created lies about you, gossip, slander. And they've done this in a community setting. And it's sad because they really have done all that they could. You know, they've used every tool that they know of to do all that they could to try and slander you, gossip, you know, bring you down. And once again, they think they're the smartest person in the room, but they're not. I kind of feel like this is a narcissist, right? This is a narcissist, but let's see. Let's continue this. Okay, two of cups in reverse. The devil. Two of wands. Yeah, this is someone who's very much unbalanced they're unbalanced and they really just seek to destroy you i'm not exactly sure why but they're emotionally charged up in the wrong way their actions are all wrong and yeah this person just really has been seeking to destroy you but just know that they are unhinged they are unwell and it's probably good for them to seek some type of treatment. But let's see, what can you do about it? Okay. Okay, so this is the emperor in reverse. This is the two of swords. And this is the six of swords. Okay, so advice for this situation is to definitely... Do not confront them because they're unstable, they're unhinged, but make sure you think about what you do. Make sure you're thinking your thoughts through clearly, making sure that you plan, that you are planning your, your words, make sure that you're planning your, not responses, but it's kind of like, make sure that you're making a plan for yourself. You know, that, that may include, you know, speaking with a lawyer. Make sure that you, you know, you may have to file some defamation suits. What, whatever it is, but make sure, make sure you plan accordingly. And unfortunately, dealing with this is going to be a journey. It's going to take you, you know, places where you don't want to go. It's going to take you and bring you into other situations that you don't want to be in. But... This is for the best for you because you're going to learn in the process. So moving forward, be strategic. Be strategic in all that you do. If that means, you know, making copies of documents, if that means blind copying people on email to show that this person, you know, is lying. If that means, you know, recording conversations with this person, whatever it is, be strategic because they're going to take you for a ride. They're going to take you for a ride if you already haven't 
you know, if you haven't been on a ride already, they're going to take you for a ride. And, you know, it's, it's going to, it's going to hurt you emotionally. It's going to take an emotional toll on you, but I believe that you're going to come out successful in the end because you're going to plan. You're going to be strategic about it. And just know that this journey is part of, it's an experience that you're supposed to have. And, you know, it's it's distracting you and it's taking you on an emotional journey. But I feel like if you plan, if you be strategic, if you cross your T's and dot your I's, you're going to come out of this on top. So just, just know that it's something that you're supposed to deal with right now. And, you know, be strategic, plan accordingly, do not confront this person, but just know that you're supposed to learn something from this, all right? Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.